No shameless secrets from your past? Actually, maybe there's one. I knew it. Back in Minneapolis, my best friend was Marjorie Miller. And she was going out with Jim Townsend, who I thought was really, really cute. So once we were at this party, and Jim and I were alone, we were outside or something, and somehow we started kissing. Of course, I liked it. Marjorie heard about it that night. She called me really late. He woke up the whole house, and she was crying. She was hysterical. She kept saying, how could you do that to me, Brenda? How could you do that? And the part I hate to think about is that I know why I did it. I did it to break them up. Did you guys ever become friends again? Not like we were. Brenda, I have a confession to make to you. What? After you started going out with Dylan, I tried to get a date with him. What? Brenda, I have always liked him, and he was flirting with me all last year before you moved here. Did you ever go out with him? No. Well, obviously, he wasn't interested. Okay, Brenda, I get the picture. I was just trying to be honest, but I, you know, I thought after what you said, you would understand. What, understand that you were putting the moves on my boyfriend? Look, just forget it, all right? You know, ever since you started going out with Dylan, you have developed this side of your personality that's completely unbearable. Donna, is that true? Well, you have become a little stuck up. Me? You and Kelly are two of the most stuck up people I've ever met in my life. Fine. I cannot believe you guys. I came here tonight because I thought I was gonna make good friends. You guys are so gossipy. Thanks for the memories. I'm out of here. So am I. Me too. Told you we should have gone to the frat party. Hey! We even put Amanda in the circle. That's right, Amanda. It's your game. Oh, forget it. You guys are all a bunch of dupes. I would never tell anything private about myself. Wished I hadn't. Me either. Kelly, no. I'm glad you did. What happened to you was a terrible thing. And I'm glad you told us. And I guess it's nice to know that you're really not so perfect after all. What would ever make you think I was perfect? Brenda, I'm sorry. I would never try and steal Dylan from you. Hey. I lost one best friend because I'm some stupid guy. I'm not gonna lose two. I'm sorry I called you pretentious. And I'm sorry I called you gossipy. It's okay. Sometimes I am. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, I'm sorry for not having more problems. But I plan to. And when I do, I'm going to need your shoulders to cry on. Thank <laughs> you.